Right, well, you know we couldn't get through the show with just one St. Patrick's Day story, right? Unfortunately, we can't have any fun cooking in the kitchen, but you can. Our partners at Parents Magazine are always sharing a cute recipe that everyone will love this St. Patrick's Day. For this recipe, you'll need sugar cookie dough and food coloring. Divide the dough into four equal portions. Add food coloring to each one and shape into a ball. Wrap and refrigerate the dough ball for one to two hours. Then remove the dough from the refrigerator and make 10 to 12 one inch balls with each color. Lightly flour your work surface. Flatten a blue ball into a half inch thick disc. Roll a green ball into a thin rope and wrap along one side of the flattened blue disc. Repeat with a ball of yellow dough and red dough. Lay a piece of wax paper on top of the cookie and gently roll it to help the color adhere. Repeat the shaping and rolling steps with the remaining dough. Then bake them according to your recipe directions. While the cookies are still slightly warm and soft, trim their edges with a butter knife. Colorful and sweet, these lucky rainbows make a delicious St. Patrick's Day treat. I like that. That looks tasty. For more baking and craft tips, visit parents.com. That's parents.com, not parents magazine, parents.com.